Good morning, guys. Dogecoin still in the show again, up 7.47%, and we're actually up 33.87%. I'm also going to show you guys how $1.5 billion entered into Dogecoin within the last 24 hours. Let's just dive in and talk about this. Good morning, guys. My name is Travis Smart with Trade Confident. I hope you guys are having a good Tuesday. Um, guys, we're going to dive into this. Everybody's wondering about Dogecoin. We're trying to figure out this one thing. How high is Dogecoin going to go here before we should really look to take some profits here to then buy back in lower? Because if you guys have been following me on this channel, the goal here before some massive moves come, you know, specifically before April of 2024, where the next halving events expected to happen, we need to be accumulating as many coins as possible while Bitcoin, Ethereum, and obviously these other altcoins are low. But in today's video, let me give you guys some, some proof of where I think this is going to stall out of where we should probably look to take some exits and then buy back in lower. Because I think you guys are going to enjoy this a lot. Let's start with um, just taking a look at this article here. Obviously, Dogecoin's pumping. Dogecoin jumps 8% overnight, continues two week rally. Pretty much, it's like, you know what, crypto market, you guys go sideways, I'm going to pump. The industry's first and largest meme coin now boasts a market capitalization of over $14 billion, a hefty increase of roughly $1.5 billion since yesterday. This was written today, about four hours ago, just so you guys know. Um, it is also the best performing digital asset among the top 10 cryptocurrencies on the day. And we can see over here that it is absolutely crushing everything else. Nothing comes even close to it, up 7.47%. Okay. Here's the plan and what I plan on doing if you guys would like to follow me. We're currently pushing uh, over 100,000 here, but 102,000 on our account here, and Dogecoin is our number one coin in our portfolio. It wasn't my number one pick. Actually, EOS and Cardano were my number ones, but because Dogecoin is pumping up here, it happens to be number one here. Okay, let's get into the meat of this video. We're up 33.87% from the trade call that we made. If you guys want to get into this, get a membership. It's in the description. We do very good trade calls. We've actually also never lost a single scalping trade call. We've called for you guys. And we started this on uh, May 23 uh, to 23rd of this year. My apologies, guys. It closed on the 23rd. We actually started on May 18th, actually. And we're up 381%. So we're doing really good. Now, <laughs> let's get back to the analysis. Here's what you guys need to understand. Why did, why did Dogecoin stop right here? Do you guys know? Let's start with that. Let me just actually come over here and put a horizontal line. And let's take a look at this. Let me go like that. Okay. Why did it stop here? It's because of structure resistance. And you're like, where is it? It's it's not due to this, guys. It's not due to that. It's actually due to this. You actually have to come over on the chart. Let's go left over here and take a look at this structure resistance over here. It's from this big gorge or this valley over here that we ended up making. And it's right around this level here of about 10.80 cents. I'll zoom in there so you guys can see that. This structure support over here is now acting as future resistance. So that's key number one that we need to be watching here is we need to understand that we're coming up to very strong structure resistance from the past. Number two, make sure you guys are watching the trend exhaustion price as well money flow. I'll do a pop-up right now. You guys can get a discount for this um, in the description if you guys would like to get these on your charts. Trend exhaustion shows if the actual trend is exhausted. And yes, guys, mark these words. Like we are not going to see this trend continue this fast for, for, for a very long time. The trajectory of this trend is too high, too fast. You are going to see some money moving out of the market. I'm going to try to explain to you guys when I'm looking to exit. Because with me in this group, we have about roughly $35 million. And this is not financial advice, guys. But when I share what I'm doing, a lot of people choose to do the same thing because we have a really good record. So I will be calling that out. I will actually be calling this exit out for everybody in our um, inside tips. And you guys just need a membership for this. Shameless plug here, guys. It's it's well worth the money. $25 a month. Um, you guys will get access to all the charts. You guys can see what you get. I don't want to spend a lot of time on this, but I will be calling out all the exits on this. Okay. Let's get back over to Dogecoin, link in the description, all that fun stuff. Here's what we need to be paying attention to as well. The price risk well money flow. Well money flow obviously is moving up here, but we are sitting at a metric value of about, let me get exactly on this, 52.71. This is far from being topped out. That's what you need to understand. We just came from a topping out period here of 98, well, basically 97.59. We have plenty room for whales to continue to buy this, but we have trend exhaustion very high. Okay, mark those down, guys. Now, look at this. Let's move our way up here. We have what's called the TC market reversals. This actually tracks stochastic, RSI, MACD, um, MFI, uh, CCI, all of those big indicators that retail traders use. When those are overbought, 
it's red. And when they're oversold, this is actually green down here. So we can spy on retail traders to say, all right, what is the majority of retail traders looking at right now? And they're actually looking at overbought levels in the market. So they're probably going to look to take some profit soon. Now that we assess that, we need to go over to the blue chips and see what Bitcoin and Ethereum is doing to see if we can actually get some more pumps here simply from the big boys moving up or moving down. So let's pause this. Now let's go over to Bitcoin. What you guys probably don't see or, or potentially don't understand of what's happening right now is we are actually getting pretty bullish. If you look at this, you're like, no, I don't think this is bullish. Like we're still in a triangle pattern. Normally this goes to the downside. Yes, we were, we were looking at that yesterday, but I need to share this with you guys. You may not know this, but in a descending triangle pattern, many, many times when you have price action come down, come up, come down and back up, and you start to hug a descending resistance, this is usually where you're going to see price break to the upside. Let me prove it to you. Take a look at this over here. You see this move up. Let me get this. Let me pull this down just a little bit more. I'm, I'm over marking something. You see the move down. You see the move up, the move back down, the move back up. And then you start hugging the descending resistance. Usually a sign that you're going to see a move back up. What's happening right here is you are getting everyone who went short right here getting trapped in the market. And you're seeing people close their stop losses or they're actually doing buy stop orders above descending resistance or you have people buying in the market. Basically, everybody, no matter what side you're on, is going long. Do you see what's happening right here on Bitcoin? I do believe, guys, you will see this break to the upside. That's my call on this. So we're seeing this price hug right here. So Bitcoin going up, potentially seeing a break to the upside, will actually add some buying power into the market, which where you'd normally see Dogecoin move back down because of the trajectory of how high this is going, it can't be sustained, may actually see a little bit more of a pump up because of Bitcoin giving us and presenting us this bullishness. And we actually wicked above this just a little bit already. Let's continue here. There's more I need to show you guys. Ethereum. Yesterday in our membership, I ended up calling this out for you guys under the inside tips. You can see this in this video over here. I'll scroll down real quick. We do something every Monday called Money Making Monday, and we share with you guys how we make how we're going to make money that week. And then we do something called um, Future Forecast Friday. Well, in yesterday's video, if you guys play this, what I called was Ethereum was going to break back down to descending resistance, and it was going to pump. And it also came out with a thumbnail about this yesterday. We saw the move up here, the move back down, the descending. Res my, my apologies, guys. Descending support. I apologize about that. Mix that up there for a second. Descending support, and then we're looking for the move back up. And we got that. That was very, that that's really good. But understand, the point of me saying this is this is actually looking pretty bullish. And so we have Ethereum bullish and uh, Bitcoin bullish, which will most likely try to make Dogecoin bullish. Let me move into the last part of this video of where I'm going to look to take some profit because I do believe it is very, very wise to not try to hold on to this asset until, you know, kingdom come over here where we just think this is going to blast up here to the top resistance and keep going. I do not believe that. It's, it is also not wise. I'm not a financial advisor, but it, in my opinion, it is not wise by any means to hold until this area up here. We must look to scale out. So what I'm going to be doing, guys, I, I'm looking at this. Let me put this over here so we can see our percentage. 33.06 at the moment. I believe Doge Dogecoin has the potential today, if we can see Bitcoin break descending resistance here, Dogecoin is most likely going to fill the gap for us from where we're currently at to structure resistance, which is about another 6.48% move up. What I'm looking for is well money flow to be a little bit high here, probably pushing around the 70, 75 uh, metric value. And I'm going to look to take out probably around 5 to 10% of my Dogecoin simply to exit some and then buy back and lower if it crashes. But follow me here in the wisdom here. I'm exiting 5 to 10%, which is going to be leaving what's left, guys, 95 to 90% in the market. So if it goes up, we're still going to be earning on a vast majority of our Dogecoin. But if it goes back down, we've bought ourselves some insurance. And what we can really do, which is very favorable, is buy back in lower because we exited some. When you exit some right now, which I believe, watch this. This video is going to come out and you're probably going to see the market actually move back down a little bit. But because I'm, I'm going to make a call here soon. We've got about roughly $35 million following the calls that I make. Not that I'm I'm calling out. I, I'm doing what I'm doing and people are choosing to follow me because we have good success. But I am going to be looking to take some out of this market here because I do not believe this is going to keep heading up as fast as it, it does. If Bitcoin, Ethereum break up, cool, we're going to earn on maybe 95 or 90%. But I am going to be looking to make an exit here pretty soon. So two things you guys want to do, get a membership over here, just $75 a month. I showed this to you already right over here. I'll give a link to you guys in the description and pin it to the comment. But also make sure you guys are watching the trend exhaustion, the price for swell money flow. And when we get that next sell signal 
or the next strong sell signal, you really need to be watching that over here or when price action comes and hits this red line, which is a moving resistance, you need to be able to watch that so you can look for the move back down. That places us up here at around 11, that's actually gonna be probably pretty close to 12 cents by the time this matures and gets up to this area. So watch for price to be around this red line because that's another place you probably wanna look to take an exit. So follow me here. Next time we get a sell signal, the next time we get a strong sell signal or price is pushed up into a red liquidity pool where long trades look to take profit, that's probably going to be where you want to look to maybe allocate probably 20% out of your Dogecoin and get it into cash to buy the move back down. I do not believe crypto is going to see massive, massive pumps here within the next few days. I do believe there's going to be a little bit of a correction, but I do think we can see a little bit more of a move up here. I'm talking like maybe move up to here and then maybe a move back down. This move right there on that move down is is going to be the perfect accumulation spot for everybody in uh, cryptocurrencies, especially Dogecoin. The indicators real quick, guys, trend exhaustion, price as well, money flow, as well as seven other indicators, a total of nine you will get with our bundle pack. People make lots of money with our indicators because they really, really do work. You can look for that yourself. When you guys get the bundle pack today, you will get source codes to these indicators, as well as you're going to get a 53% coupon code off the top and bottom finder. So it's actually cheaper if you guys buy the bundle pack, get the coupon code, then get the top and bottom finder with the 400, literally guys, it's $400 off, then buying this outright. Getting this and setting up the buys, the sells, the strong buys and strong sells is gonna give you such a crazy advantage in the market. I've been covering it literally for the last week because of, of sales we had going on. Make sure you guys are snagging this, set this up for yourself, and literally, you're getting a $400 coupon code. It is the it is the biggest discount possible you can get off the top and bottom finder, just so you guys know. $400 is actually more than our Black Friday and Cyber Monday deals that we had going on. It's because we honor all of you guys who buy our bundle pack first. You guys then get the coupon code for $400 off the top and bottom finder, so you guys save yourself a massive amount of money, and you literally have then um, 11 indicators, the nine for the bundle pack, and then the two up here, top and bottom finder, and then the market reversals. Set them up on your charts, guys. We're gonna keep showing you how to use it on this channel. So you're not just buying something here where you're like, oh, I bought it, what do I do with it? No, like literally we have videos coming out, roughly one to two, three videos every day on our channel here on YouTube, showing you guys how to use this stuff and make money, and if you guys are in our membership, I'm calling these trades out for you guys. We are 381% higher than the S&P 500 and have never lost a scalping trade yet. And we're managing a couple down here. It's a really good place to be, guys. I really believe it going into fourth quarter here. I love you guys. Have a great day. Everything you need is in the description. Watch for my call in the inside tips when you guys have a membership because I'm going to be exiting. A lot of people are probably going to exit with me on that. So uh, you might, <laughs> you might want to take advantage of that and just get into that membership as we make some calls here pretty soon. I love you guys. Have a good one. Everything you need is in the description of this YouTube video. And I pinned it as a first comment on this YouTube video as well so you guys can see all the links. All right, guys. I love you. Have a good one. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.